739 right now on this Monday morning. When the skies turned black yesterday over Romeoville, John Stonebreaker reached for his camera. He caught a small tornado on tape. John, joining us live now to tell us about what he saw. Good morning, John. Hi, how you doing? I'm doing okay. How are Great. you doing? Tell us I'm all about fantastic. it. I'm doing fantastic. Yeah, I'll tell you about it. First of all, you're um, right outside Alberto Culver, the new Alberto Culver, greatest company in, in the world here that I work for. I just wanted to mention that before we go. Okay. Give yourself a raise, John. All right. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, yeah, I was uh, sitting at home and... Uh, you know, it started raining, they had the Romeoville Fest going on, it started getting dark out. I happened to have my cam on looking at some uh, doves out, or some birds out on the wires. I was showing my, my 12-year-old, uh, my 14-year-old that uh, they were up there. And all the, the sirens went off, and so I quit filming out there, and I set the camera on the table, and my son looked out the front bay window. And uh, he yelled to my wife, she, he said, Mom, it's coming right at us. And uh, she turned to me and she said, John, it's coming right at us. She said, grab the camera. So I grabbed the camera. I stepped outside the door. You know, I happened to forget I had my underwear on. I had my hearts and my red heart underwear on there. And I just stood there and started filming it. And it was coming right at me. It was a great, great, great tornado. It was funnel cloud. It was, you know, it was just beautiful. But it was coming right at me. And it hit me that it was coming right at me. So I was just about to turn it off. And uh, it started to go a little bit north, and I just kept on filming it until it, it just basically just, you know, dissipated up into the clouds again. And all the neighbors were out there wanting to see the video, and then uh, you guys came out and got the video. Yeah, we got it. It's pretty good stuff there, John. Hey, listen, you know what? The, you know, we can make light of this because nobody was seriously hurt. But, John, i got to tell you, when I see something like this, maybe it's because all these years being in the business, yeah. I should get the camera out. But I usually go to the basement or try to find someplace safe. I sent so all the what family was going down through there. your head? Why were you doing this? Oh, no, I, I sent all the family down. As soon as they told me it was coming right at us, I said, all of you guys go downstairs. And, and I stepped out, and I seen it. I seen it was far enough away, and I just started filming it, and then it started going north. So I, I kept on filming it. Uh, it, 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 it. It quit coming right at me. It was, yeah. I'm sure it was the talk of the town among you and your neighbors. Everybody doing okay out there? Yeah, yeah, the neighbors, they're, 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 everybody was kind of shook up there, you know, because it was, they had the Romeoville Fest going on, and there was a few hundred people in there, and uh, luckily when the rain came first before the funnel cloud, and they shuffled them all off into the rec center before the uh, sirens went off, and then the funnel came down. Good so, stuff. Uh, yeah. Hey, listen, John, uh, have you ever done TV before? Uh, actually, you guys have been here at Alberto before. Yeah, a few years ago, and you guys were out front on the other side of the building. Because you need to come out of your shell a little bit more, my man. You're, you're a, little, a little bit too quiet this morning. All right, we're oh, joking really? about it. But we do thank you for your time and, you know, good handiwork with that video camera. Hey, thank you. Thanks for, thanks for taking the film and uh, showing it there. The kids got a kick out of it and all the neighbors. Our and, uh, pleasure. Like you said, luckily nobody was hurt, and it was just uh, something... A good exercise. Let everybody know to take take shelter with something like that mm -hmm. when the sirens go off. All right, listen, my friend, you take care, and uh, next time a tornado comes in your neighborhood, be sure to uh, grab that camera again and give us a call. <laughs> okay, I'll try. I'll do my best. But I, I know you will. <laughs> All right, John, John Stonebreaker, you are the man of the moment there. We do thank you for your time. Brave man, very All cute, right. very very funny story. He's true. He, what he said is very true. A lot of people do tend to take pictures, and they want to take video when they see something like that. Mark, I'm not on that team. I usually just go right down.